Hi, welcome to this tutorial about data merge. Have you ever faced a problem where you have hundreds of certificates that are supposed to bear names of participants? Uh, it's quite complicated if you choose to typeset or copy one name at a time and paste it into a, a certificate. Now, in this tutorial, we are going to see how you can do that in a very simple way using InDesign's data merge uh, script. First of all, ask the client to give you the names of the participants in an Excel sheet and open that sheet or workbook. When you open these names, please save these names as save as type CSV comma delimited this format here. It's the one that works with InDesign data merge. Just accept this and having saved that, please make sure you close this. Do not save. Having already saved, it prompts you again, but don't save. Now come over to InDesign here and pull a new document. Uh, I will not, I know I don't need facing pages and I need A4 size. Say OK. Now go to your pages panel of InDesign. If you don't find it here, please proceed to window and say pages. Go to your master pages. This is where you're supposed to place this repeatable item of the certificate template and you press it in the temp in the master page. Now switch back to page one and put in a get your type tool and create a text frame and type here a, a sample name let's say Monica Jessica I'll control a press control a to select all I'll give it around um, 55 55 I'm going to give it a font known as Great Vibes. I'm going to center this here. I'm going to give it a color. You format just one name. The rest will emulate that. And I'm going to make sure this is really in the center of the page. You're going to select this name go to window utilities data merge go to the flyout menu and choose select data source having saved this csv you will have your data source here and in the whole list we only need to pick the name so that column of name you click it over here and it will, it will give you a press holder here you can preview and you can merge you can even move through the preview and if everything is okay you click merge button you can choose to merge all records or a range of them or just a specific record but for me i'm going to go for all records very good they are telling me no oversets text if i go through what the InDesign has created for me it has given me a new document with with all the names pulled from the excel sheet i'll save this as uh, i can take this call this i always want to say merged all right and i'll save that since i'm going to print i will not take the InDesign document but i will I would put a PDF out of this by going to file Adobe PDF presets. I will always go for high quality and this is what I will output. I call it output. I will say okay I want to view my document after exporting. I will click that say okay so InDesign now has created me this beautiful PDF with all the names without any hassle. I'll 
across that. If you feel like this tutorial has really helped you in some way, please consider a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to this channel so that when I output new tutorials, you stay in the loop. Thank you so much. Senyalo Bashil, Skita program of Hyperango Digital.